Pope's body found in Eagle Pond. The search is over. Very sad ending to this case we've been following. The body of a missing two-year-old boy in an Eagle Pond has been found. The Ada County Sheriff's Office said Rory Pope's body was discovered Saturday morning after crews drained the pond. He had been missing since Wednesday afternoon. The search for missing two-year-old Rory Pope is over, the Ada, Ada County Sheriff said. He was recovering from the pond behind North Arena Avenue early this morning. Crews had spent all night pumping water out of the pond. He was found when the water level dropped. It's been a frantic search for the little boy since about 12.15 p.m. on Wednesday. Hundreds of law enforcement, firefighters, divers, neighbors, friends, families, strangers, all looked for little Rory in the upscale neighborhood, but he was nowhere to be found. Family had been packing and preparing to leave Rory's grandparents' house and return home out of state. It's kind of typical because we're, we're, they're doing things and packing and getting ready to go and Rory's a very outgoing two-year-old, like two-year-olds sometimes do, just take off running. Uh, Eagle PD Chief Matt Clifford said on Friday, and he was gone for a matter of moments out of sight of the parents. Rory Pope's grandfather, Dave Wilkinson, made a statement on Facebook thanking everyone who helped in the effort to search for Rory. Wilkinson said on Facebook, the outpouring of offers to help to find a need and fill it for my family of food, toys for the other children, the prayers, good wishes, I don't have the right words, and no, thank you is too small of a gratitude for what you all have done. Thank you. Wilkinson said that Shauna Green started a GoFundMe site for Dustin and Brittany Pope. Pope's grandfather, Dave Wilkinson, made a statement on Facebook thanking everyone who helped in the search effort. Wilkinson said, the outpouring of offers to help to find a need and fill it for my family, of food, toys for the other children, the prayers, good wishes. I don't have the right words, and no thank you is too small a gratitude for what you have all done. Thank you. Rory's body was found after the water level sufficiently dropped. He had been missing since Wednesday afternoon, and for the past few days, hundreds of law enforcement, firefighters, divers, neighbors, friends, families, and strangers worked together to help look for little Rory. This is what the Ada County Sheriff's Office said in a statement. We live in a community full of people who care deeply for each other. We all hoped for a different outcome. Today is a hard day. I want to thank everyone who helped in the search for Rory. I want to thank everyone who had thought or shared a prayer for him. Rory's family is asking for privacy as they mourn their loss. And if you would like to support this family during the difficult time, we have a link to their GoFundMe on IdahoNews.com. Here's the GoFundMe for Rory Pope's family. Um, I am just going to scroll through and you can pause to read it. It's a very sad story. We've been following it since Rory went missing on Wednesday. And this is not the outcome we had hoped for. If you can donate, please do. Link is going to be 